What is going on guys? You are watching or listening to Jay's Two Cents. This is my channel. I just tweeted out that I fixed the stuttering problem on my Battlefield 4. And I thought that maybe this was common knowledge, but based on the amount of people who immediately told me, How do you do it? How do you fix it? How do you fix Battlefield 4? Help me, help me, you must tell me the ways. I decided it, it warranted this late night emergency video. Well, I guess it's not really that late. It's only 11.42 p.m. But when you're old like I am, that's pretty damn late. So anyway, we'll go ahead and get my ugly face off the screen here. And what you need to do, open up your Windows Explorer, somehow, some way, there it is. And you're going to go to wherever you've installed your Battlefield. Now that's up to you. I don't know where you installed it. I installed it on my third hard drive here, BF4. And you're going to navigate to the Battlefield 4 directory. When you open that up, you're going to see a bunch of folders and a bunch of files. And you want to open up underscore installer. Now you're going to open up the DirectX folder, and you're going to open up the Redist folder. You're going to sort by alphabetical order, and you're going to scroll down to the Ds where you're going to see DirectX setup. Because you see, here's what happened. DICE, in all of their infinite wisdom, especially for teaming up with EA, and probably some of the stupidest things they could have ever done in the past, but I digress. They forgot to install DirectX with the installer for Battlefield. So they don't have optimized DirectX drivers built into the game because the game has its own DirectX that communicates with your DirectX 11 or 11.2 or whatever you got. And they forgot to install it. Those bastards. So anyway, double click the DX setup, accept the agreement, hit next, hit next, and watch the green initializing and installing bar of awesomeness move all the way across the screen. And when it does, you can open up Battlefield 4 and bask in the glory that is stutter-free operation, smooth frame rates. Now, if you were like me, you were getting high frame rates with really bad stuttering. And this fixes that. So there you go. If you know someone playing Battlefield 4 and they're complaining about horrible stuttering even though they get great frame rates, show them this video and you can guy and both you guys can laugh together at just how stupid Dice really is. So there you go guys. Hit that subscribe button if this video helped you. Hopefully you're already subscribed. And I'm gonna get on out of here. But remember, when you hit that subscribe button, you save a kitten in third world countries from being eaten by zombie babies. Good night.